So, Chris, you think you might have caught an STA? Yeah. Okay, well, it seems like fun, but sexually transmitted affection can be quite serious. If you catch feelings and it goes untreated, it can lead to staying in more, more excessive brunching, or in some more serious cases, even marriage. Oh, God. Did you take any kind of precautions? Yeah, I told her that I wasn't looking for anything serious, that I just got out of a long-term relationship, and I said I might even be moving away for work. Great, and uh, what kind of symptoms are you having? Well, when I was at her flat, I went for a pee, and I felt this burning desire to wipe the seat and put the lid down. Mm. Is that a symptom? Well, it could be, but it could just be a sign of a good upbringing. The other night, we started a box set together. One thing led to another, and we spooned all night. Okay, well, that, that does sound quite serious, but we don't know anything for sure just yet. We're just going to run a few tests. Let's have a look here. Yeah, I can see some glimmers of hope there. Now, how do you feel when you see a picture of her? Um, yeah, uh, great. Okay, I can hear some butterflies there. It's not a good sign. What about now? Who's that guy? Who's she with? When was that taken? That's her ex. Does that hurt? Yes. So based on everything I've seen, I think you have caught feelings. Um, is there a cure? Oh yeah, it's cured quite easily. It's just 10 days of ignoring her calls and sleeping with people you don't care about. I'll just give you some reading material here based on if you'd like to cure it or if you're happy to live with it. All good in there? Yeah, everything's fine. Right, do you wanna go? Yeah. Brilliant. I thought we could grab some brunch with Susan and Ian. They wanted our advice on curtains. Does that sound good? Sure. Okay, let's go. Just one sec. Okay. 